morning um i hope you enjoyed those mood board boards um i wanted to show those because they don't always come out exactly how i like envision them in my head because sometimes i mean i'm just picking things that i think are visually beautiful but they won't always work well in the space for example the master bathroom um i had picked the vanity that i'm sitting yeah, I was going to cut off the back legs and attach it to the back of the wall. And then when it came down to it, <laughs> it was it didn't fit. It works out better that it's out here, but the more you know. I'm going to do my lashes really quick. And then I think I'm going to... Emery's wallpaper came in for her bathroom. I might tackle it. And Andy was like, you're going to do it by yourself. He knows I get super overwhelmed with stuff like that. So I'm, I'm going to roll it out and see what we're working with. And then... Um, and then if I do end up doing it, I'll for sure take you along with me. I wanted to say that for the mood board that I created for down at the pool house, I'm already having to tweak a couple things because the niche tile that I picked is from, it's like, it's a clay tile and it's not available for, it's like back ordered. So I like having those mood boards so that I can like take things in and out and see if they're still going to blend well. I almost forgot. Big, big news. Dime has come out with another perfume. It's called Seven Summers. And it's supposed to remind you of like happy times in the summer, like late nights at the pool, hanging out with your friends, at the campfire, roasting marshmallows. And it really does like bring me to that feeling. You guys know that, which one is it? I love this one. Malibu Night is my favorite. But the seven summers, I'm not mad at it. What I love about Dime perfumes, first of all, I'm going to put the notes of the new seven summers perfume on here. Um, but all of their perfumes last on your skin and on your shirts or whatever you spray it on. There's nothing worse than buying like candles or perfumes and then you can't even smell them because, I mean, what's the point? You invest in something, you want it to last. I can spray this on my sweatshirt and wear it all day the next day put it back on and it's still there and these perfumes are super affordable with my code lacy you can get an additional 20 percent off as well you can get the seven summers big bottle and then a sample size of the other four perfumes if you want to try them all or you can just buy a sample set of all of them to see if you like it so i'm going to link the dime website here for some reason i'm not able to add the question on here but someone had a recommendation of the sliding doors that open and we do want to do that too the doors that we have are the same ones as these they're this is off of the kitchen they're gigantic and beautiful but they're not super practical they're really heavy um and they're a little dangerous even maverick i don't think i ever showed you his thumb but he slammed his thumb in there and it's completely black so we do plan on um adding sliding doors or I'll show you a picture of them, but they'll open completely up. My dear sweet child, that's what I do. It's what I live for. Ow! Geriatric millennial is hard. If you're wondering if you're a geriatric millennial, you have to be born between the years of 1980 and 1985. I just happened to land on 1985. <sighs> Meet me at the club at 830 sharp. Oh, bless you. Um, I did want to mention that I was serious about the mood boards. I love doing them so much that I would love to find a way to make them for you guys but it would have to be like totally streamlined in a way that um, I understand what you're loving wanting needing and budget blah 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 and then also I'd have to figure out a way for it to be like monetized for me since I do spend so many hours on them I mean I literally it literally took me like probably two to three hours 
if not more, to make that one um, for my pool house yesterday. And because I'm taking time away from my family doing that, um, that's why. So if I do offer that at some point, it would be through my website, which I'm still trying to launch. I'm a procrastinator. I'm not an interior designer. I did not go to school for it. I just know what I love from trial and error. Um, but like outside of Instagram, that's something I would love to do in the future. When Instagram goes away, maybe. Which I hope never happens. Make you smile whenever you're sad. Carry you around when your arthritis is bad. All I wanna do is grow old with you.